Also, I have not read the books. Shameful, I know. Nah. I just... I'm not really that much of a reader. At least not when it comes to, like... I will... I will read... specific things that interest me, but... Now I can actually see that this is algae. I think before... I thought it was just like a pool of chemicals. Well, it is also chemically interesting still, because, like, it's very blue. And, like... It's interesting for sure. Yeah. I imagine they won't have changed this section of the map too much. More fire marbles as the light source. This music is new. Oh, this is different. something just set in like this world feels more real than the original Riven did in a way I mean the other one felt very real but that was because like for its time like it was doing a really good job but like just comparing strictly you know, forget about when it was made. Obviously, I mean, this isn't really all that special nowadays, I know. But, um, but just the way that things are put together, it just, like, rounds out the edges a bit more. And things feel more, like, lived in. And I like how this feels is very I'm not sure this is gonna work at all. I 
I know what shape it is. Yeah, I suspect... Oh, wait, we can't walk across there. I really like being able to walk around these. I feel like this would be way less stable. It's a log in a wa in the water, like it will roll. But because it's a game, we just kind of act like it doesn't phase us. so much like destruction or whatever what happens if I enter from the other side nothing seem necessary to like load new map when uh, when entering this area but considering that it is kind of like a hub for spaces like it sort of does matter gotta load at some point, you know. Granted, I have not yet used this to go from point A to point B, but that doesn't mean we can't. Um. Before I thought that we were like rotating everything else, but it's more like we're rotating ourselves. And we don't even really feel the change in gravity. I don't know. Who's to say what's rotating and what isn't? I mean, there is gravity here. Like, it's. I don't think I'm being forced to hold on to the handrails to make my way across. Like, you know. I think. So I, are we going to have to visit every single one of these? I think we will in order to make the connections. I'm not sure, but it's kind of how it seems. So we can really go anywhere we want, though, right? Oh, I guess... Oh, can we not, like, 
See, if I just wanted to, like, travel along here, it forces me to fall blind. That's fine, I guess. Oh man, I don't even know. Okay, let's go back to where we came from, which I think is this one. interesting is we can't yeah see I thought that initially when I started messing with that I literally thought we were rotating that stuff I didn't realize we we're just rotating this center piece um, you know it's interesting that these are like well I mean this is what this the starfisher is like I mean it matches the original game in that sense. It, it is a strange... It's like it, there's just portals inside of it that open up. Interesting that these are like disc-shaped portals. But yeah, I mean, that's how this is. It's just like that. Is for having a ladder there. Ah, they slide on a one of these puzzles. Not too hard to solve. Wait. Me, no, I'm doing that wrong. I think. See, I was not supposed to... Okay, we still need to figure out how to get... This pass there, I'm not sure. Um... This kind of gives me a diagram of where they should be. But, um, oh, okay, hold on. Yeah. Can't do that because it's... Can't just move them in bulk. Eh, come on. Ok, 
Okay. Hmm. Yeah, it's... Oh. Oh, no. What? Why? <laughs> Why do you have to reset? Okay. Alright. E oh, you know what's interesting, though? It's not... Like, this was way easier this time. I wonder if, um... I wonder if it randomizes at all, or... all this There's a little light there We had I don't remember exactly where these were. But I don't know what this little blinking light there. Um I was right there. Maybe I should just copy that. that we do not have a um, fire marble puzzle anymore. That's been completely removed in favor of other things. is doing a bit of pacing. show? He must have woken up. And he sees that I've escaped. And 
he has no idea what to do with himself. Oh, you know what? I think he's been told to keep watch over this. I mean, it might not be pressure sensitive. I think that gate was put up as soon as we arrived. Well, why wouldn't you just keep the gate up all the time? Right? I mean, maybe he's there to keep watch, but like, why wouldn't the gate just always be up? Why, like, why is it even open? Right? I don't know. size of the body. are important so as before we will write them down um, so this is something it's broken we don't know this one
this. It is green. So yellow, but I think that's like orange. Has not changed much from the original game here. Like the still these. Well, see, this is more like a greenish yellow, and this one's more of an orangish yellow. we need to be able to call a work here because um, I, I don't know I mean I get that it's fed back at the village island temple or uh, jungle island so I don't know actually a lot more. I think this is more animations than the original game had. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just forgetting. Let's do it again! <laughs> I don't know what'll happen if I do it again, but let's try it. I bet it'll just like not come. Or maybe it will come and we'll flood the place. Wait, whoops. I was supposed to... Wait. Oh, will it not let me do it again? Interesting. Okay. That is interesting. There used to be, it used to be you generally come here from over here. There was a branch, and it did go this way. But, yeah, no. No? Yeah. Right, well, we've seen that. I know what I haven't done yet. I like how they're like shiny where they've scraped against each other. Well, you'd expect them to not have such a uniform, like all black at the tip sort of thing, but. 
I, I can appreciate not having a ton of different textures because um, more textures just bloats the size of the game. <laughs> and, you know, I, I don't actually love that. So, anyway. It's so responsive to what I do. It's like, sit down. I'm not closing the door if you don't sit down. literally been holding a pen in my the same hand that I'm touching the mouse with this entire time. Well since I wrote this stuff down anyway. Am I just gonna finish this game? I might. We'll see. Okay, so that was... Oh, Ganscribe. The achievement says it was Ganscribe, so apparently it's Ganscribe. Metagaming.
This thing is not sketchy at all. So it looks like this one also has an alternate path. Which way did he go? That's the question. I think I know where this leads. We might as well just go the way the game kind of... I mean... Yeah. We'll go this way. It is interesting, like the plants that are just like a single leaf, single blade, they just grow up. Who knows what the root system is like. Now, I'm not supposed to know, but like, it used to be that there were some triggers of some sort on this. I guess not. Now they're just lights. So you can only exit from here. I'm guessing. So I get far enough away from it. Oh, I don't know. Whatever. Maybe it just stays open. Until I pull the lever to close it back up. Yeah, see, I didn't come this way. But we're back on. This is why they call it Jungle Island, because it actually does have a little bit of a sort of jungle to it. What is this? It's the triangles and quadrilaterals and pentagons, apparently. I have no idea what this is. Classic beetle. Man, if someone plays this version of the game first and then they play the old version, they'll be so confused. 
I think this game w I think playing this game would actually make you have a harder time figuring out the old one. I don't think that they were worried about that. Oh. Who made that dagger? Actually, I think I think this was drawn into the world or uh, written into it. Right, I forgot about this path. Or at least I think this path always existed. It's easier to stumble on stuff in 3D when you can just freely look around. Otherwise, you just like miss a little hot spot and you just never know. Yeah, so because the water behaves the way it does in this world, um, you know, these are, you know, probably like, um, the fissures, for lack of a better word, you know, vents, volcanic vents or whatever. And there are a lot of them. So, yeah, that's interesting. suppose this is a sacred spot. Hey, I just had a thought. What if the Rivenies don't bury their dead? They feed all of them to the work. And then this, they're, you know... Oh, this is the one that was taken out. This is the one that's in Gan's place. It was a single triangle, I remember that, of unknown orientation. <laughs> um, the colors? Did the colors matter? Because this is like painted like a... bluish light green color does it seem particularly different from I'll just write that down although I'm not sure that the color is what I should be caring about here I don't know. like to close behind me automatically. It's a little bit freaky. <laughs> Some weird mushroom things. You know, in the original game, these uh, these felt more like artificial inserts, but 
weird, like they look like actual bits of plant life, strange as they are, you know, that serve as light sources. Yeah, I guess the use of music is pretty much the same as it was in the original game. Just at certain places. And it's not like in your face, it's just, it's there. Gives some cultural context. Wait, what? Oh. start going out. No, I have to light them all up at once. Yeah. Oh. That was cool. Okay, I'm going to pause for one second here. Actually, no, I'm going to just stop here and continue this later. This is good for now. Um, last night I realized, um, when I was talking about how Cho was just pacing around the, um, the entry point to Riven from Dunny, um, I was kind of forgetting that it was jammed, so it couldn't, the cage couldn't be closed. Of course doesn't really answer the question of why they don't just keep it closed all the time um, and who knows maybe it really is pressure plated I don't know it's not that important I think a lot of it's just for effect what is the shape in the rock looks kind of interesting so it looks like a lot of this is this scene is pretty similar but not the same we do still have that uh, sacrificial uh, lift, I guess. Uh, once again, they are locking me out. Do not trust me. Or anyone, probably. almost seems like there's more homes than there was in the first game. The old game. I see before. Okay, we can't. We can't do much here. There's that, um. Uh. Porthole or whatever it is that we were looking through. You can definitely can see the, like, here's the Rivenese, and then there's Gan's influence. Like, hmm. Alright, so if I can't do anything right now... I do kind of wish that this had a day-night cycle, uh, but I don't think we're going to get that. I... I don't know. Is there a particular reason why it shouldn't be? Like, that, the, that we shouldn't have it changing? 
Other than that, it's just not really necessary. And that's just a lot of extra work. Maybe. Well, there is one place we haven't been to yet. That's up here. Which we can access from here. Ah. Uh, so the mouth is still open. I'm not sure that, um... The Rubenese are supposed to have access to this. But whatever. I don't even have to open that up. I can just... Yep. Ah! not like the old game. Oh my gosh. Just leave it open. That's kind of fun. Because, you know, like... Yeah, no, that's the size it'll go. Um, yeah, before it would close automatically if you tried to go up the elevator. Or down the elevator. Actually, I don't remember. You know, the perspective is just so different when I'm able to just look out at the other islands from all these different angles. This is not different. Yeah, they haven't... Uh, so it used to be that one of them was a different color, and that's how you knew which one was supposed to stop on. But I think now the only way to know is just by, like, at that uh, big gold dome. Um, what symbols were on there? And by the way, I did not remember. I, I may have kind of remembered from the playing the game before, but anyway, not that it really matters, because you just spam. Let's, uh, I'm not going to go there just yet. Will it stay open forever? Or will it eventually close? It is kind of a strange thing. I don't think the sun's supposed to flicker like that. <laughs> well, maybe it is. Wait a minute. Since... Huh. Okay. I thought it was just a bug. I guess it kind of is. It's just a little more active than it should be. It's like because it's near something, it... Anyway. Oh, I think my eyes hurt from looking at the sun. Is that the only thing this does? So important. So I'm gonna guess that, that this part hasn't really changed much. Except I have no idea how to get over there. 
Because I don't have access to the submarine. It does seem like I will at some point. We might have to connect all these points first. I was supposed to do that with all the others. I'm not so sure I did. What's this? this button. Oh, is it gonna shoot it? That is convoluted. I mean, it's like a. Can they not be transported just by hand? They need to be carefully handled. So we throw them across space. This isn't exactly space, but... Oh! Just wait a minute. Hold on. I said I connected every bridge. that there were that many because I thought there whatever okay um I don't know why we are doing this <laughs> particular order, but... Oh, I should have... Oh, whatever. I'm not doing things the most efficient way. That's okay. shooting the balls charging this I guess I don't know why it looks like a lighthouse lamp lantern or whatever those are called it absolutely is that's what it is so I wonder where they got it from whatever I mean, it's 19th century technology. Well, 
Obviously not all of this is. I should probably pay attention to which one as I do. Maybe the uh, maybe what it is is that the other one was already connected. Disc-shaped portals are weird. Oh. if I try and mess with this again. Guess I can't. Because it's already um, There are plenty of questions to be asked about how gravity works around here. be possible to charge from like all four sides except for the last one. We wouldn't have to come over here. Because you just go the long way by traveling in Riven until... Okay, so we probably have not done this one yet. sure. But see, I thought I was trying to charge this. But actually, I think what's happening is this is charging the fire marbles. And the fire marbles are being sent through the chute, once they're charged, to, um, to power the book back at uh, the big dome. We've been there, right? Let's see. Uh, I don't know if we went there. We did. Let's see, so we've done three of them already. So which ones have we not done? Well, actually, there's five. Did 
did I not do this? It seems like I did this one already. I'm sure I look like an idiot. <laughs> nah, it's fine. I don't think I've done this one yet. Just a. I wonder how he created these connections to the starry expanse. Or, or, oops. Not where I wanted to go. Let's just go down. All the way down. There are exactly five bands on this. back and forth. Sorry.
I actually want to go... It's not really a shorter path and it's more steps to, you know, go to this point instead of just going to where they both intersect. Anyway. I think this is the one that I have not been on the other side of. I made a mistake by... Hmm. It doesn't really matter at this point. Oh no, I had to rotate it anyway. That's right. I was thinking that it was already been before, but it's not. It wasn't. It would be kind of nice if there was a way to just rotate, but it would actually make the... I'm sure it would be a more complicated engineering feat. to build something that could rotate both ways. Um, I don't know. Or at least it would be more work. And it makes for a bear puzzle that it doesn't go both ways. I know the original version of the game it meant fewer <laughs> Uh, images and recordings or uh, renderings that had to be created. I mean, there were so many images of the gate room because of all the different states it could be in. Hmm. Well, this rock is. Whoa. Is this split at multiple points? Wow. Okay. 
Yeah, got our charged fire marbles here, so. Oh, hold on, what are we missing? Oh, it's a button. This is kind of like the fire marble puzzle, except it's presented now in a way that kind of makes, seems more complete, I don't know. Is this is like to check or whatever. Okay, I I know how perspective works, but why does it feel like it's narrower on the in the middle? And it's probably in my head. Yep. Actually, it may have something to do with the FOV and all that. Okay, so, oh, um, hold up. Let's see if I just lift this. There we go. Oh. Oh, wow, I am literally being expected to know all this <laughs> of course well it's good but because like I, f I think it's a lot more explicit so it's not like it's like a version of the puzzle that's not going to leave you confused about what to do it's like yeah we know what we need to do and now we're just like um what is it again <laughs> you know um because we know our colors, um, I just need to know, oh man, I might have to go back to the survey island, because, uh, well, hold on, we know where they go, right, like, I don't, like, forget about knowing which color goes where. We know, that, like, one of them was here, one of them was here. Um, I think it might have been there. I, I actually don't remember. Shoot. I might have to go back. Wait. Oh, one has to go here, right? Okay, I think this was in that spot. Maybe up here, but I'll go with that because... But yeah, um... Oh, wow. 
This is okay. So this would actually be a this is actually a good puzzle. Like if I didn't um if I was new to the game, this would offer quite a bit more challenge. Now we can solve this part. This part's not hard to do. Um we just need to uh look at our pictures. Yeah, I should have taken more pictures. Um Oh, you know what? No, nah, it still wouldn't still won't help me. Oh well. Oh I'll actually write this down. So this is a minus three. Wait, what even is the center? That's what gets, that gets a little weird. Oh wait. So that thing I was playing with before at Engan's little, uh, workshop should have taught me like what was what where the equilibrium is at that was the point of it it was trying to show me where zero is and now i have to remember where zero was at and i don't quite remember but i understand now i get it man okay well so Green is plus five. Orange is minus. Oh wait, orange is minus three. The question mark one isn't even being used. Or is it? Yes, it is. So that's the purple. And that is plus 16. Blue is 7. And then we also have red, which apparently I forgot to actually draw the full symbol for. I hope that that's all that went wrong. <laughs> is, uh, Oh wait, that's seven. Wait. Hold on, so red is minus seven. That other symbol is 12, plus 12. Right, well, we got that much. I might have to, I don't know if I'll, it'll remember where these are at or not, but plus 16. So I think, I think zero was, um, positioned at like here or here. I'm not sure. I kind of think this is where zero was at, actually. So in that case, this is where orange goes, and then red... Is this three? Red just goes there. Green being plus five, if that's that one, two, three, four, five. And then... Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And 16, right there. I think I might... Wait, was that not... Oh, X was the button, yeah. So I don't know if I got that right or not, but just a screenshot to remember if, in case I actually have it right. And if not, I just have to shift them over by... I mean, there's only so many possibilities it can be anyway. Since there's like... This is one of three positions that they can be in. Assuming I even counted properly, 
which I might not have. But... I'm not even sure where they're located, so I'm gonna go ahead and just try to how, how do I try anyway I think I would know right away if I had gotten it okay well for now we can at least make note of which island is which this one is the green All right that we can't see is blue. So it's a small little island out there. This is purple. The uh, square, in other words, Minecraft circle-shaped island. What's this? Oh, it's the survey island, okay. What's that? Tetris piece. A couple of them are Tetris pieces. Tetronimos. I assume that is referring to the jungle island. Not entirely lined up. Is this like the really huge one? Like I'm drawing the shapes on the paper. Okay. And that's all of them. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I'm I'm gonna just go back to survey uh, island and. I need to ask myself what the fastest route is. Going through the gate room takes time. I don't actually remember what was down here. Ah, oh, that's right. gonna have to go through the gate room. The I probably will. That's fine. Let's see. Oh. Right, I already have this open. Just leave it this way. I mean I could No, we're not. We're not going to mess with the gate room. We're going to leave it how it is.
So I have the urge to look at the door as it closes, but it doesn't let me do that. My view is locked in place here. I can get up now that... Oh, wait a minute. I can get off over here? That's cool. Is that a old submarine those? Oh. Oh wow. Okay. Guess we had maybe some accidents before we installed the bumper stopper. It does seem like this used to go out maybe to Prison Island or something, I don't know. Hmm. I'm glad I got off. I didn't actually... I would not have seen this if I didn't bother to turn it around. I totally wasn't going to, but like... disconnected right there. I'm pretty sure that's... We need a closer look at it, but I'm pretty sure it's just a wrecked, like... Like, not broken, but just straight up wrong. Like, a mistake in the... mapping of the game. This one we were able to walk all the way around, though, right? So we didn't need to... Yeah. Riven just has really blue water. That's just how it is. I guess the sky is unusually blue, too. But no, it's different. Like, the sky is, like, very blue. This is, like, a blue-green. So. But even then, like, when there was no atmosphere to reflect... The water's just kind of bluish. Oh. So I might want to make note of this. So this thing just rotates. We don't know. Okay, let's see what we can learn about this. Oops. Haha. <laughs> Pressing X when I'm trying to go backwards. So this one looks kind of green. The other one looked green too, but it was like a bluish green. I mean, if it was just in different lighting, maybe... But yeah, this one seems... Oh. Yeah, doesn't that look weirdly very blue for being indoors? this other one. Okay, yeah, this is definitely not the same color. This one's more like white. I guess. It's just like the color of the wood almost, but it does look... Wait a minute. Wait a minute, hold on. 
Oh. Okay. Of course. Right? Yeah. There we go. All right, makes much more sense now. Um, so... I don't know... All right, well, so anyway, I'll write this down. So the one that's, like, white-ish is a uh, number two. <laughs> Wait. Are these arranged in a particular pattern? Like, did someone place stuff to attract them? Is there something special about the rock? I don't know, but what are these circles? Anyway. Alright, um, I will go back. I wonder if they painted anything on this. I'm not seeing anything. Where the flies at? There are flies around this. Maybe I only hear flies, I don't see them. This might be a writing anomaly. Not sure though. Okay, so this one that's like a darker green. supposed to see here I don't know maybe I'm supposed to look at it from the other side I don't know for all I know this could just be to get my attention so I figure out this but I mean, obviously, right? Oh wait, no, this has any number of configurations. But this is where it should be, so. Anyway, that is six. I believe there might be six of these, not sure. I thought for a moment these might be cave paintings, but I don't think so. It's just stuff that's growing on the, tr the uh, rock. Is there anything down here? Um, you know what? Um, 
I got this thing from. Is there somewhere I can view... That's the only place to get a good look at it from would be like... Maybe... From the, uh... Tram thingy. I can't tell what this is. Oh, wait a minute. I do think I see it. It's like the fish. Right? Is that what this is? I need to see it from another angle, but I think that's the fish. So... Oh... Maybe made from these flowers, then. This is making me want to go back to Gan's workshop. that right? Okay. So, uh, this one also has like a, the exact same like whitish color. I'm not sure if the color is on will matter at all. Anyway, this is three. Looks like the same shapes are on top. I don't think these, there's any real difference between these. I'm sure that they made them look similar so as to not leave me thinking that the differences between them was supposed to mean something. for a minute that it was special, but it is not. I doubt there will be anything in here, but...
Well, I don't know really what to think. We saw what looked like a fish thing. it is possible to not disturb them. I mean, anywhere here could be... I mean, probably not, but... I could think the location's... I don't know what I'm supposed to see in this. Can't see that from here. I'm not sure I can pull this out while on the tram. Also seems, yeah, just forget it. So, I wonder, I guess the moths glow because they also, like, because they eat, or they, you know, they drink the nectar or whatever of the f flowers. They pollinate those flowers, probably. forget there was yeah down here definitely written in well this is the Okay, so, well, we know that the marking is on top. So, we'll have to, we, I guess we will have to go back to Gan's workshop. So, I wanted to go back because I wanted to look at this stuff again. Now I have a reason to. Ah, wait a sec. Okay. Yeah, so it's not like... It's not like there's a spot where you see it and everything looks perfect. But you can see... Oh wait, hold on. Never mind, there is a spot where this all lines up. Oh, and it highlights? All right, well, anyway. Hmm. These were called sunners. So there might be one near every single one of these. 
I mean some paint glyph near every single one of these. Five guy feeds people to the fish. Wait. Oh. Oh, okay, gotcha. I'm looking at the dagger. Nice. That's cool. Makes me wonder what else I'll see if I just keep looking around with it. But I don't know that it'll be much out here. I don't think there were any of more of those totem things. over here yet. No, no, no. Hold on. I think I remember now. No, I don't remember. Oh. Okay, this is important. What's up here? my 
microphone. I need to reposition the blanket that's wrapped around me. That's what I'm doing right now. I should also get some water. The way that it follows the track still looks just as fake as it did before. Well, less fake actually, but... your guys' village. So this is, uh... I mean, I know from before this just determines which way... Oh. We don't want to go back the way we came. Okay, I'm guessing this sets the destination. So like, if it's here, and I press this... Yeah. Okay. Um, let's go here. But I think... Oh, I don't really know. It just determines which direction it goes, you know, around the circle, I suppose. Although, it has a fork in it, so I'm not really sure. Maybe more to it, you know. So we close this up, which is important. Three buttons. Ah. Uh. 
This version makes so much more sense. It seems much more efficient, at least. <laughs> it blows them right down into the water. Let's see. I don't, I, I shouldn't have known that I was supposed to do that, or that I was able to do that. That looks pretty cool. But I mean, this is exactly how it was in the old times, so I already knew that this was the solution. So I just pressed the middle button. What happens if I press the top button? Ah, it was there for a very specific purpose. Okay, well. Seems to be sleeping. Bozo, wake up. the guy free. And he's gone. So, I guess he just, as soon as it was open, he just magically disappeared to his home. Nothing to see here. Can I see something from, uh, no, nothing stands out except for this. The symbols of the rebellion. Seamless. Well, actually, I take that back. <laughs> From a distance, it is seamless. Well, almost. Interesting how you don't really notice it unless you look up close. And then it's like. This part. They have not changed this. I love. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> this is really something. I got. I, this must be special in VR. I wonder what that's even like. I don't know where I'm going. It's worse than feeling your way around because it's a game and I can't even feel. I just hear when I'm moving. And I'm, I'm moving my mouse around so I might end up back where I started. I don't know. Wow.
What the heck is this like in VR? I like it. I, I like it. I'm not complaining. It's just amazing. Darkness as a game element. This would be so bad in real life too, because you're just getting lost in a cave. At least in real life you can feel. I've said that already. Maybe if there was like some haptic feedback, I'd have to plug in the uh, controller for that. Oh dear, I'm so lost. I don't know if I'm going farther away or... See, I know that it's just one single path, that it doesn't fork, or at least I don't think it does, just because in the previous game that wasn't the case. But yeah, this was so different in 2D because, you know, you would just click around and you get where you need to go. curious what this is like for people in VR. I'm back where I started, yay! Wait a minute. Hold on. Ah, I'm so dumb. Alright, this makes so much more sense now. Oh man. <laughs> What's it like if I... Oh yeah, so you can always see it. See, just because, like, in the original version of the game, it was, you know, the, it didn't matter. You just click, you know, and you'd eventually get to where you needed to go. So. But, yeah. Actually, I wonder if, um, there's anything out here. But, maybe not. Interesting. So it's like a strike on. Like it, it hits the. Okay, the animation's a little bit wrong, but it hits against the rock and activates, which is cool. Shall we continue up here? Don't suppose there'll be anything else. Can I turn it off? I don't think it works that way. I'm sure it just lasts for a certain amount of time. Now one thing I don't quite understand. Um, the guy who is in there must have known that he could trust me <laughs> because there's no way he would like upon the door opening for him to be, just be like well guess it's time for me to disappear out of here actually he probably assumed like maybe it was out of fear you know he thought he was about to get eaten 
so he's like, well, it's my time to get out. Just disappear, so. And he does that. I mean, it is in the dark. It may be hard for someone to follow after, but even still, just the fact that they know that this is a secret pathway. Um, I'm at a gaming too much. I mean, I'm not supposed to know all this, right? Anyway. Oh. Okay. So that exits out to here. Is there a way to go back? Maybe not. Oh man, and I didn't even... Wait. Why are they blinking? Oh. Wait. I didn't look. Was there a combination? Like... I don't know what the combination is. But was, was that trying to tell me? Uh, well, anyway. So much for that. We'll, um, I can't go back that way. I'm going to have to go all around again. see it move in there. You know, I would absolutely just hop down and climb up. This is really a slow way to get across a small little gap. try it before because I was pretty sure there wouldn't be anything here, but there's nothing here. back there or do we want to go to these other places first? I think we should to at least like open things up.
it's taking the other track. Okay. So what does it always just take the most efficient route? So what's the point of this lever then? If it never goes backwards. Well, I guess it does. Okay, I take it back. It probably does give me some control over the path it takes. And who knows, there might actually be a bigger reason for it. Oh, well, this was not helpful. Back in there. Alright, one place we haven't been. Oh boy. He's very... This guy is so... I mean, if... I mean, the temple should have been a clue enough, but Gan is very full of himself. Like, coming here just to speak. I mean, I assume it's the type of microphone. Yeah, I just kind of crazy. something. Okay, so we're going to go in the opposite direction. Yeah, see it is absolutely a heater. I think I like the idea of leaving it just slightly out. Yep. Oh wow. I I didn't expect it to let me over. I thought it would like create an invisible wall, but no. Okay, so let's see. How many times can I pull it up before it'll stop me from using it? When do you think it'll stop working? Surely at this point that might be too much. Oh, yep. I, I was actually expecting the wall to be placed up there, but I guess that makes sense. Alright. We'll release it. Oh, is that because it hadn't been used for a while, so it turned off? Cool. Okay. Because that was an illusion. It looked like that was moving for a second there. But I'm probably wrong. Anyway. Wait a minute. Okay, but this one's still active. Let's go up here.
Now it feels like I'm trespassing. place we haven't been, right? Oh. Yeah, okay. So... So, you have the pod. So, like, I think we saw that the flower glows. But the pod's, like, inside of the thing. Those are what get turned into this paint. It's interesting that... Yeah, okay. I'm assuming it's five knocks, as before. <laughs> so rude. Oh, the game just crashed. Haha. <laughs> Whoops. Well, that's that's interesting. I don't know what I did that caused that, but I guess just that little sprint there. Um Wait, hold up. I just ignored the error. I just like right clicked, went back to the game. Let's save though. <laughs> I hope I'm not saving it in an a broken state though so let's save it as a new thing well, that's interesting so now nah, the error message is just gone what the heck okay so I guess it, it countered encountered an error but like now I want to like reproduce the I don't think I'll be able to. Oh! Actually, I just did. Do we want to watch the intro again? Maybe we want to watch the intro again. Can I skip this part? Oh, okay, no, I think I just skipped the whole thing. Maybe you can't skip the Unreal Engine uh, logo, but then because I so if I click continue well I don't know if it's continuing from where I was or from the save because they're basically the same thing right now so the thing that's kind of cool about Riven in its contrast the, the way that it really stand like um, because after Mist, which has a lot of going back and forth um, between worlds using the Mist books, um, when you when you get to Riven, and there is no using any books, not for a while, right? Um, that that void then exists and that and like you feel that change uh where you're no longer using mist books all the time and you're just in this world and i think that that actually increases the effect of immersion 
um, where like it feels less like a game you know like it's it's like or it, it just it rather emphasizes the contrast between it and mist it emphasizes how important riven itself as a world is that you don't need to use mist books for it to be a whole thing on its own you know like I, i'm i'm not my words aren't the best phrased here, but... Oh, you know what? This might be related to... Like, being able to... So that's to help weight it, I guess. I'm not sure that totally makes sense, but okay. Oh, oh, I see it's anchored at top. I didn't notice that. Okay. Oh, this is for the tree? Is the tree changing at all? I don't think it is. It'd be kind of silly if the tree instantly changed. Unless it's that kind of tree, you know? Then I think this really was abduction instantly responds, you know, to... Okay, whatever. So, hey, so we have a frog here. That might be important. Wait. Nah, just, just the tree. It's so, just a bit, you know. Okay, have I not? Is there anywhere I haven't gone here? I don't think so. I think I've been everywhere up here now. Wait. Hold on. So, we had... that and then there's this which is nothing so I think I know what their diet mostly consists of what was that I don't know why I wish I could. Do I actually wish I would? Does it really matter? Okay, so that's just the wind. Alright, let's go back to our car. Keeping it warm for me. Well, I guess what we need now is just to go back to here.
Oh. You know, I think those sticks might be made of, uh, the, the blue tip glow stick thingies that are in the cave. I think that the tunnel, I think that they might be made from dried out those things. I don't know why they still glow, though, but know, maybe whatever chemical is in them is still functional. If it's just, like, squeezed a little bit, I don't know. So is this like the mist elevator? Like if I press this, will it immediately... It does seem like it goes a little faster. So it's like if you push the middle button, it gives you more time. What if it doesn't even do anything until it senses weight on it? Okay, so it does work. Top to middle. It wasn't actually what I was trying to test, but I just kind of did it by accident. I'm pretty sure if I press this button and just wait, it is going to go up on its own, so. Ooh. That it was a little trippy. I think it was like about to go up and then I got on it. Yeah, I am making a mess of this place, leaving doors open all over the place and you know, just well overall just Is it here? Where was it? We will close this behind us, though, because I don't know why it's, like, both ways. I don't know if that's a mistake or what. Oh, actually, you know, it kind of does make sense. So, like, you twist it, because it, this just stays in that position. You twist it to open it, right? You twist it back to close it. So, when you open it the other way, it doesn't... Yeah, that's... That's just how it is. Don't think about it too much, but uh, it probably does make sense, actually. Even mechanically. It's just... No. So I went this way before, and I still kind of do want to... I still do want to kind of... Well, I imagine I'm going to come back this way later, but... Anyway... Okay, so, okay, so those three, just those three, okay, so the two middle ones and then the one on the end. That's not too hard to remember. Oh, okay, now I can do it. This is a game that will give you an achievement for basically entering things from every possible angle. <laughs> or doing things. Okay, so this room looks very familiar. I mean, because I've played the game before. Yeah, so I'm guessing there's six of them because we already counted up to six with one of them, and, uh, well, we just, we don't know the solution yet. And I'm hoping that the combination is different, you know, than it was before. Oh, 
Oh, that's a thick barrier. I think I could walk into that. Maybe I wouldn't be able to um, breathe in it, but, you know, I could at least touch the stone. But yeah, um, unfortunately, I don't have... I'm almost certain I have to do these in order. Uh, that's kind of the point. Right, there's there's six, and the only thing I know for sure is that one of them is this. Um, and I don't even know what number it is yet. I although I have a guess, but it's one, two, or three. <laughs> but um, yeah. So one of them's the fish too, but I'm not even sure what number the fish is. Maybe from, I'm probably from another angle. But yeah. Guess I'll exit this way. What if I had, like, because I was messing with these before, there is a possibility that I'd accidentally trigger it. I wonder if, um... If it would have stopped, like, if it would have just not let that happen. Or if it would just be like, okay, yeah, there you go. Got it. Now, yeah, I'm gonna... Actually, I might take the submarine back. I gotta get to... There's some way, and I'd have to, like, rotate the maglev around and all that. That is just a lot of work. Oh, actually... I don't think I'm going the right way for this. Where did I leave it at? Oh, shoot. Should have gone back the way I came. Because, you know. that back up. Let's also... Actually, let's leave this open. So, if he escaped, he definitely escaped through here. Like, taking the time to close it behind you is kind of weird. And anyway... also be kind of nice to see, like, you know, traveling back. 
Um, God. Not that it particularly matters, but... My theory would be that this is the faster route. already faced the right direction. I just, well, I, maybe I want it. Okay, so that's interesting. But that, that is something over there. I saw something there. And I want to understand it. Maybe I'm just seeing part of something else that's from above, but... So I need to climb down here while what? I need okay. I need to somehow climb down here while this isn't here. But while the water is open. And I guess that means sending it off and then like maybe Oh, okay, 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 hold on. Yes. Because it stays open, because we know this, it stays open for a certain amount of time. So all I gotta do is go, like, to the next stop, and then run over. Which won't be hard, because that's just right there. Like, that's quick, that's not too bad. Floating thing also a type of fire marble. Okay, let's hurry. I know we have a decent amount of time, but but I hate to miss it, you know.
Now, what happens if I just stay down here? Okay, it won't let me won't let me burn my feet. I'd like to know what happens if I just stay down here and then it closes up on me. Wait a minute. I'm going to save. Sure. Just a, yet another save. I can just delete all these, but whatever. I'm curious, though. Like, this will... Will this turn off on me? And then I'll be able to get... Like, will it be a game over? Or what will what, happen? Or will it never happen? exactly how long it takes. Alright, um... I think it should be closing about now. So if it doesn't, then it's just staying open for me. Which is kind of what I expected. Oh. Oh. I just flipped the switch so now this stays open. And I didn't even notice that until now. Okay, work. Where's like the, the statue nearby? Okay, so I can flip this switch back. And then I can drown myself, yeah? Just gotta wait for a bit. Still might not happen. Have we waited long enough? Probably. Yeah, I don't think there's a game over here, unfortunately. Is it unfortunate? Maybe it would really annoy someone if they had to lose to something like that, you know? Wait. It still isn't closed? Really? I thought, like, as soon as I got out, it would close. Do I have this backwards? I might be severely underestimating how long it takes to turn off. Of course, it could be that the timer doesn't start until I'm no longer down here. And so, in that case, I'd have to wait much longer. So, I don't think it's... 
I don't think anything's gonna happen. Wait. Oh, hey! Yes! Oh. Oh, okay. Good compromise. It doesn't just end the game on me. But it does happen. It does shut me out after a bit. Okay. Cool. I'm glad I tried that. Because that actually does happen. Alright. So... We saw a work. Oh, can I also just like... Yeah, I can also just view it from here. I wonder, was there more purpose to this? Or was it just to draw my attention to, you know, the panel down under the water? Because I really wouldn't have paid attention to that otherwise. I mean, it didn't seem like there was anything else to do there, and clearly that's what the lever does. It just, it just keeps it on. Surely that's all it is. Okay. Um... Wait a minute. That thing is moving. I am being watched. Well, you don't have to make it so obvious, man. It's like without fail. Look at that. It's like a robot. That makes you think that it's just like tracking motion, but I don't think that's what it's supposed to be. I think there's supposed to be a person behind it. If you want to intimidate someone, just without fail, just keep moving the lens to focus on them. Ah, you can't really see me now. Well, probably not. Not totally, anyway. These are fruits that float. Ah, and they're used for fishing. These are traps. What kind of bait is there? I can't tell. Not sure if there is anything in there. Yeah. Okay, but um. Oh. Didn't see that. Sometimes the entrance is below. That makes sense to me.
I don't think there were any up here. Maybe I'm wrong, though. That's a little bit of a reach. Oh. I didn't come here before. So it's just so I can look at it. Just look down the hatch at the seam. Oh, this is a lever. Okay. Does. You know, like, what was, you know, what steam was being released that can now be, oh, oh, hold on, okay, I see. We need to go back down there, don't we? Yeah, it, I thought it was a little strange. Oh, this is a totally different vent. Yeah, I can't exactly get there from here. But, uh, that opened the door. Alright, well. We know what we gotta do here. Gotta bring it back. still be in the way, so we need to take it back. We know that it lasts for a pretty good while, but I'm still running. <laughs> we'll leave this activated. Steam just sort of pushed the door open for me. All right. Wait, what? Um, okay. What? Huh? 
What is this? An automatic door? Oh, there's a pressure plate. Yeah. Or no. Well, I mean... This does look like a pressure plate. It doesn't actually go down. We don't see it. I, I don't really understand because it opened on its own from outside when the steam was first redirected. I have no idea. Whatever. Okay, it's already basically in the right spot. Just adjust that a little bit. Okay, what number is that? It's four. So work is four. What else glows around here? Nothing. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Was there like a. It looked like there was a cable. I don't even know. This will it close at all? Okay, so we've done that. I think we're going to head back to where we were going to go, which is, um, Oh, I totally could have taken, you know what, and I will. I actually will. Before we got distracted, I'm going to once again go back using the submarine. Considering how far I traveled out, I'm not sure it's actually faster, but... stop soon, actually. Just 
I go here. a screenshot just in case I can't remember that but uh, yeah it's actually not the most obvious but it, you can also kind of figure it out like you know you can see oh there's that and there's this you know out there yeah. so yeah We're gonna go to actually let's shortcut our way. I don't know if I can even call it a shortcut. But we're gonna go this way anyway. Many ways to get from point A to point B. Does not look like I'm able to untie that. If I could then I could also float my way over there. I wonder why. This place must have had some history, and then again, just like completely pur repurposed it. Well, I need to stop it first. Yeah, 
basically like it's face towards us. Now the question is, can I remember which symbol to go to? Actually, I do know because I know which island goes with which color, and I know which symbol goes with which color, so... But I, I was just gonna... I think again I ended up taking a longer path to get to my destination. Maybe I just like <laughs> using modes of transport. Another camera that wants to follow me. Yay. That's right, Anne, I'm getting into all your stuff. Okay. So I did want to look at this even though you know.
Right, so it's a number one. Let's make a note of that. Actually, we already did know that one way or another. And then I also figure I'll go ahead and look at Actually, it's not the only thing I want to look at, but... What did this say again? Yeah, okay. Um... Ah, uh, okay, so it's one over. Take that a screenshot as well. But, um... So we'll make that adjustment. I also was kind of interested in, um, let's see, actually, yeah. yikes. What I thought what I was looking at were flowers for the open pots. I don't know. Okay. Yeah. That's all. We're not going that way. Actually, let's see. Yes, that'll take me back there, which isn't really what I want to do. And that bridge is down, so I think we'll just come back through the... ...space. Travel through the stars.
your hair. Oh, they're already... That's right. I was like, where are my marbles? They're placed over here. Okay. So, we made note that this is zero. So, if we have minus three, that's only here. Probably correct. If I didn't uh, count things wrong, like I said. Okay. Um. And then it was like up here. This one actually is purple for a fact. Um, I'm gonna have to check my pictures. Okay. Ah, uh, okay, okay. All right, so let's see here. Um, this one is in fact green. Um, red is down here though. Um, this one is blue. Okay. All right, I think that's good. Let's see if we got it right completely. Oh. That is different. Right? Or no? No, maybe I have something wrong. Or not, I not. Hmm. Oh wait, hold on. I know. I know why it's different. Because I didn't pull the lever. Oh, that's cool. I let me pull the lever before.
that's new. I apologize for the cage. I'm afraid this situation has often required of me a more primitive code of conduct than I might otherwise have chosen. I am Gen. I assume you've heard of me. Yes. Well, I suspect you have acquired some false information of who I am now. Not that my son would have lied to you about me. No, not Atrus, it's just that... Well, I'm sure he believes me to still be the depraved father I once was. Yes. I even tried to kill him once. God, if I had accomplished that, who knows what I would have become. A great father indeed, who tries to murder his own son. Thankfully, he trapped me on age five, a prisoner of my own creation. No books, no precious inks, no ages to link to, nothing but my own foolish ambitions. That was 30 years ago. 30 years, 30 lifetimes, what does it matter? No sentence could be too harsh for the man I was. But, I have changed. Did break eye contact. Be sure the deeds of my past can never be completely atoned for. But my mission was an honorable one. I'm sorry, this is all a bit awkward. I it's been a long time since I've attempted to persuade any one of my intentions. Most of the people here have already made their minds up about me one way or another. I myself do not trust the words of most men, so I don't expect you to believe me. In the end, though, you may discover that I do have more than mere words to offer. Atrus's choice of punishment has been hard on the people of Riven. Many have suffered because of it. The island has been steadily decaying for years, but according to my most recent measurements, it appears that the fifth age has entered its final days. Unless the villagers can be relocated soon, the island will collapse entirely and everyone will perish. It has taken me a long time to do it, but it appears that finally I'll be able to make some substantial amends to my past transgressions, especially in... Well... I'm afraid I've had some... trouble with Catherine and the moiety. In any society, there will always be a small percentage of the population with rebellious tendencies. Before Catherine appeared, the moiety, as they call themselves, had been relatively harmless. I mean, the natives here are a fairly violent people by nature, but I'd almost come to accept their presence. Upon Catherine's return, however, their violence intensified considerably. It seems she's become some sort of religious savior to them. As far as I can tell, she's come to believe this herself. So I've had no alternative. I had to separate her from her people. The actions of Catherine and the moiety have put my own life at risk on numerous occasions. Consequently, the lives of all the people here Therefore, I must ask you to refrain from any attempt to free her. Although I'm sure Atrus desires it. Indeed, he must desire it with all his heart. 
but he is completely unaware of her recent state. I know that you arrived in the Fifth Age with a book which was immediately stolen from you. Needless to say, its reacquisition is of interest to me, though my personal history with the moiety does not give me much hope for it. Still, there is a chance you might somehow manage to retrieve it. If you do, I would ask for the safety of all concerned that you bring it to me at your earliest opportunity. Again, to be honest, my reasons here are partly selfish. There is so much yet to be resolved between Atris and myself, especially in light of what has become of Catherine. In any case, my immediate concern is the completion of the sanctuary I've long promised to all the islanders. In the meantime, the stolen linking book. We should probably not meet again until you've recovered it. I will know if you succeeded and will await your return. Good luck with your search. I hope to see you back here shortly. used to be that the there were five books all in a circle there to go to every single um, part of Riven but um, given all the circumstances it would be redundant and also um, give me a access that I haven't yet earned so approach makes plenty of sense. But I'm going to pause here. Go to bed.